Hi guys, Marcy here from Apartment 402, and today I'm going to bring you my June favorites. So I'm super excited to share a bunch of really fun summery makeup, beauty, skincare, hair care stuff I've been using all month, and favorites are my favorite videos to film, obviously. Um, before I get started, these earrings are some of my favorites. They're not hair extensions, they are earrings. I got them at, the, at a craft show near my house a couple years ago and my, I just recently lightened my hair and I feel like they blend in so well with my new hair because they're the exact same length since my hair is so long right now. Um, anyway, I really love these earrings. They're so fun for summer and they kind of go with all the boho chic um, fun looks that I really love to wear. I am from California. I'm from LA and boho-ish laid back California styles. What It's kind of my go-to. I know that my videos, I usually look pretty preppy and girly but um Usually when I'm just throwing on an outfit, it's going to be a little bit more boho, and I know you guys asked me about a lot of the things I wear in my videos, so I wanted to be a little bit more proactive about letting you guys know what I'm wearing. So my top is from Forever 21. I got it like two months ago. My bangles are also all from Forever 21. I've collected them over the last couple years, um, except for this one. This is an Alex and Ani one I got in a glossy box, which I shared with you guys, and then my rings are from a bunch of random places. My sister gave me this one. This one I don't know where it came from, and this I got in my nail salon because it's cool. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing today, um, and I will link down all the stuff I can find in the bottom bar below. I probably aren't going to be able to find these earrings, but they're stellar and they're awesome, so I'm going to try and find some similar ones on Etsy for you guys um, so you can kind of rock this look because it's like a hair extension set earrings look, and I love it. Okay, so let's get right into the favorites. This month I have a lot, so I'm going to go as fast as possible. So the first thing that's on my favorites is the Marc Anthony Dream Waves Beach Spray. Um, I got this in my Ipsy in June, and <laughs> I love it so much. It smells so good. I used it nonstop when I was on vacation this past, past month, kind of hopping back from the hotel to the pool. It was the easiest way to get my, like to keep my wet hair from not like going crazy in the super hot Vegas weather. So I just sprayed this in. It smelled amazing. Um, and my hair just really truly had like a real beachy look to it. Um, it's just awesome. I will for sure be buying the bigger size of this. You know, I am obsessed with my sea salt sprays and my beach sprays because my hair naturally is pretty straight um, with some waves. So I just feel like sea salt sprays really enhance my natural my natural hair. So um, love, love, love this stuff. If you got this in your Ipsy, thumbs up this post right now because this past month's Ipsy totally rocked. Um, I should have done an unboxing for you guys, but I was way too impatient. So, love, love, love this stuff, and um, I can link it down below for you because it's on sale on Ipsy right now. You get, like, 30% off. Awesome. Okay. The next thing I tried out for the first time this month, as a recommendation from actually one of my viewers, um, and I will link... I will link her down below. She's totally cute and totally awesome. Um, I don't have her username on, off the top of my head right now, but um, she's awesome and she always recommends First Aid Beauty stuff to me. So I went ahead and picked up the First Aid Beauty Face Cleanser um, and I love it. Thank you so much for recommending this to me. I will link your name right here. I feel so bad. I don't remember right now, but I'm going to try more First Aid Beauty stuff just like I said I would. Um, it, this stuff is so awesome. I usually use pur Purity from Philosophy and um, been kind of, I love Purity. There's really no reason why I'd want to switch it up, but this um, First Aid Beauty Face Cleanser is really good because it really removes all of my makeup, which I really love about it. Um, I also just feel like my face is super clean afterwards. So I use this again. This is just the travel size. I used this when I was on vacation and I absolutely adored it. Um, I don't know if I would replace philosophy with this. I just really, if you want a cleanser that's going to take your makeup off, this was, this is awesome. This is probably my favorite cleanser that's makeup removing. So my face just felt so clean after I used it. Love this. Okay, the next thing is another face cleanser that I've been loving this month, and it's Herbalism from Lush. And I think I've talked about this in another favorites or a haul video, but this is a gooey green facial cleanser, but you can see I've really dug into it recently. Um, basically, you take a pea-sized amount of this stuff in the palm of your hand, put some water in, and make a paste, and rub it all over your face. Um, it has, let's see, ground almonds and rice vinegar, to kind of just help troubled skin. I have been breaking out a lot recently and I'm not, I think it's because my, my skin's a little bit more oily in the summertime months um, and really, really dry in the wintertime months. So this has been really awesome because it's kind of helped control the oil on my face, which I really, really like. Um, 
great alternative to proactive if you're a proactive user. I think this does just the exact same job that the proactive facial, facial cleanser does. So if you want to try something different, this is only like 13 bucks at Lush. I really recommend Herbalism. I'm really glad that I picked it up. Another um, skin item that's new for me this month is the Mario Badescu Drying Lotion. So this little baby is a miracle in a bottle. Again, because my skin has been a lot more oily this month, um, I've been having some more breakouts than I usually do. I have one like right here. Ugh. Now you guys are going to look at it for the rest of the video because I pointed it out. <laughs> that was super smart of me. Anyway, this stuff is cool. So basically, I, this was recommended by a bunch of YouTube users and a bunch of like my personal friends recommended it to me. So you just take a, stick a cotton swab right into this. You don't shake it up. As you can see, there's like an oil stuff at the top and then this pink sediment that sits at the bottom. You stick your cotton swab right into the pink sweat sediment and just dab it onto your problem areas. Especially if you're about to get a zit, this stuff works so well. It does not let that zit pop up over your skin and get a white head on it. It'll just diminish it and stop it in its tracks, which I love. You can like feel it working when you put it on, which I love products like that, that the second you put them on, you know that they're working and um, this is amazing. I haven't used it on a zit that's popped because none of my zits have popped or exploded since I started using it, which is great, which sounds so gross and disgusting and way TMI, but this stuff works. And I think it's like 17 bucks normally, but I got it on Hot Look um, when Mario Badescu was on sale because I'm addicted to Hot Look beauty sales. True story. Okay. Let's move on to makeup stuff, shall we? Because that was all skincare and hair care. So for makeup, the first thing I want to talk about, which I talked about in a recent haul, is the BH Cosmetics, um, this polka dot brush set. So I think this brush set's normally like 24 bucks. I got it for $18 because I had a discount on BH Cosmetics. I am in love with these brushes, all of them, like the face brushes and the eye brushes. These are just the most amazing affordable affordable brushes I've, I've purchased. I like Real Techniques for their face brushes. I hate their eye brushes, but I love these BH Cosmetics eye brushes. I've especially, these are dirty, so I'm sorry. Um, I love, love, love the blending brush. I've been loving the angled um, eyeshadow brush. Um, I've been loving this angled blush brush for contouring. It's awesome. Um, I love the powder brush because it's so big and fluffy and soft. Um, I love, let's see, I love the concealer brush. This is awesome. Anyway, uh, I've been using all of these like nonstop. They're some of my favorite brushes that I own. And again, I got the whole set with this little carrying case. There's another end to it somewhere um, for $18. So that was like super awesome. Like I can use this carrying case when I travel, which is cool. And I think I mentioned in my cosmetic in my haul that I bought it because of the case. But I'm so happy that the brushes work really well um, because they're awesome. So I'll link this down below for you guys. I'll link everything I'm talking about down below so you can purchase it. And oof, this hot weather is making my hair, like, stick. Unlike most people, my hair goes super flat to my head. Like, I did straighten it to make it more flat. But this is, like, no volume. Anyway. Let's move on. Okay, so the next makeup item that I have really, really been loving um, this month is from Benefit. And it is the Hello Flawless Oxygen Wow Foundation. Now, I don't typically like wearing foundation in the summer. That being said, when I go out, and I know I'm going to be taking a lot of photos at night, I do like to have foundation on instead of BB cream because I just like that more full coverage, flawless look. This stuff is stellar. I think I showed you guys this in a favorites like a, a while back like when I was using the sample I finally went ahead and purchased it I love this foundation so much it's medium coverage um, so it's not a full coverage look but it goes on so flawlessly that your skin just looks like buttery like it just looks perfect um, and I like that when you put it on it's gonna be different like a yellowier color than your normal skin tone but then it oxidizes and matches your skin tone exactly like as you can see right now I don't have it on right now but my face matches my, my chest area. This stuff will match your skin tone no matter what. Like, it just is made to match you all the time. So you don't have to buy two different colors in this. I will always be the color honey, which is like the very middle color um, because I'm not that fair, but I'm not that tan. Even though it's the summertime, this matches my tan skin because um, the next color up was like way too dark. Anyway, I love this stuff. I highly recommend it. It's a very liquidy foundation. It goes on really, really nicely, especially with a beauty blender. I really, really, really recommend this for the summer months because it's not too thick at all. It feels like you don't have anything on your face, which I love. I don't like when foundations feel like you have a lot on your face in general, but this one is awesome. Okay, next, skincare items. Okay, a primer I have been obsessing over is 
also from an Ipsy box that I got. So this is the Pixi Flawless Beauty Primer. Um, I don't even know what to say about this. It's like a CC cream that evens out your skin tone, like a color corrector. And then it's also like an illuminizer, so I don't have to mix in any of my illuminizers with it. It's just awesome. It goes on so flat and so perfect underneath your face. It makes your makeup go on so smooth and gives you a flawless finish. Um, it's not like pore. It does not kind of fill in your pores or anything, so I use it with my Benefit Porefessional. But I love this, and it's super cheap. It's not expensive at all. This is probably my favorite true makeup primer that I've tried that's just to give you really a flawless finish, and to, it does what it says. Plus, it illuminizes, which is just awesome for summertime. So I really, really like this Ipsy, of course, with all the winners. Totally recommend the Pixi Flawless Beauty Primer. Okay, next skin item that I have been nerving. Actually, this is going to be another primer. So this is my Stay Flawless 15-Hour Primer from Benefit. I use this with the Oxygen Wow, and let me tell you something about this combination. Your makeup's not going to come off. I wore this when I went to the Electric Daisy Carnival, which is a dance festival, and I was dancing all night long, like sweating. Like, it was Vegas, 102 degrees at midnight. Like, not even kidding you, sweat America. You would think that all your makeup should be coming, pouring off. No way, Jose. This, my make, I looked in the mirror when I got back at night from the carnival, and I was like, oh my gosh, my face still looks... Like I just put on my, my makeup 20 minutes ago. It was amazing how well this stuff works to keep your makeup on. I gave it to my friend and she was like, I'm buying it the second I get back from this vacation. This is amazing. Seriously, it's going to make your makeup stay forever. So I really, really love these two together. They just, because they're both from Benefit, they just go together so well. Whew, I'm talking so much and talking so fast. Okay, another face item that I have been loving is my NARS Creamy Radiant Creamy Concealer in the shade Custard. So during the winter months, I'm in the shade Vanilla. In the summer, I'm in the shade Custard because I do have a tan. And for me, you do have to change up your concealer color as you get more tan. It's not like foundation that can just kind of blend into your skin. It's, I mean, I just feel like concealer, you, you need to adjust as you change your skin tone. I love this stuff. This is my Holy Grail under eye concealer. It's brightening. It's lifting. It's full coverage. It's so pigmented and it doesn't crease. So I don't know. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I absolutely love this. This is Holy Grail under eye concealer. Another face item, so many face products for the summertime, of course, um, is my Josie Moran Argan Illuminizer. I might have talked about this last month, but I still love it. It is just, I have it on today. It just makes your face, it gives your face like this beautiful natural glow that you can only get from being in the sun all day. And I love it. It's just so stunning. And the gold undertones, it's beautiful. I, If you want a luminizer, get this one. Don't even mess around with the NARS ones. I love the NARS ones too. I have a couple colors of the, of the NARS illuminizers that I, I can't get enough of. But oh, this stuff is so good. This is the best luminizer of all time. I swear to you. Okay. Next face item is a cream brush blush, which I probably mentioned last month as well, but I am still using it like crazy. This is the NYX Cream Blush in the color Orchid. This is part of a hot look kit that I got. I didn't even really want a cream blush, but this stuff, I have it on today, gives you such the most amazing peachy glow ever. It's so stunning. This color is so pretty. I love this for summer. I'm nonstop with it. I like cream blushes a lot in the summer because I feel like they stay on your face a little bit better. They're a little easier to use. Um, I put this on like when I'm like right by the pool, like before I'm about to go out to the pool, I'll just put on some CC cream or BB cream and this and I look awake and I look, you know, just like just pinched cheeks. I just absolutely love this stuff. Um, and it's, I think it's like four bucks <laughs> at Ulta. I, I, I haven't even like seen it really, but I'm, I'm, it's, it's cheap. I know it is because it came in a, in a kit that was $9. So, <laughs> okay. So, the next thing I have been loving this month is another blush. And I don't know if I showed this to you guys last month. I don't think so. This is Coralista from Benefit. Um, I, as you can see, I've already, like, used this so much. I It's been loved. But um, this is the most gorgeous, ah, uh, coral, peachy, orange blush ever. I'm obsessed with colors like this. I love coral. It's my favorite color of all time. I love the packaging. I think it's so cute with, like, the little leopard print on the inside. I, I obsess. It smells good. Oh my god, it smells so good. And you get this cute little wooden brush with it, which I like because it really allows you to get in there on the cheekbones. Um, 
gorgeous Coralie Stat from Benefit. It's a little bit pricier. The blushes are expensive, but in my opinion, super worth it because it lasts all day long. Love that stuff. Okay, so let's go on to another face item. This is bronzer, and this is a bronzer I have not been able to put down at all. This is the <clears throat> Love Rihanna bronzer from the MAC, her, the Rihanna MAC collection, so it's limited edition. You can't get it anymore, but I like it because of the red and bronzy undertones in it. For summer, it's just awesome. It gives your face a glow that's like a true natural glow, like you've been in the sun, not like a fake orangey glow. So I've been into this nonstop. It's kind of dirty, but <clears throat> this color is like, let me swatch it for you guys. It's like so pretty and natural. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. So fun. Okay, so let's talk about lip stuff, shall we? Okay. Oh, actually, I have one more primer I wanted to share, too. This is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. It's a travel size that I got a while back, I think during the holidays. I'm obsessed with it. Too Faced Shadow Insurance, this has lasted me so long. I've been using it every freaking day. And it's just anti-crease your make your eyeshadow goes on perfect it makes your eyeshadow last all day my favorite 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 eyeshadow primer I'm obsessed with it and I love that I haven't had to buy another one since I got the sample like I've had it for so long I love that okay let's talk about lip products shall we I have two lip products and they're both drugstore products so the first thing I have here is actually a lipstick that my friend Nancy didn't want to use anymore and it's called just peachy and it's from wet and wild I never use any of Wet n Wild lipsticks, but this color is phenomenal. I absolutely love it. It's a peach. It's a true peachy, pinky nude. Um, let me swatch it for you. So pretty. I love it so much. And, you know, it doesn't last a long time because it's Wet n Wild, so their lipsticks cost like, oh, I don't know, $1.99. But I just love this color. It's so pretty. I put it over with some lip gloss. Usually I'll put it with my other favorite of the month, which is the NYX Butter Gloss and Cream Brulee. These two together, ah, so pretty. The most perfect, perfect pe peachy nude. It. Like, if you want a peachy nude, this is the color combo. So, it is Wet n Wild Just Peachy Lipstick with NYX Butter Gloss Cream Brulee. Stellar combination. I've been wearing it all month long. Love it. Another um, NYX Butter Gloss that I've been loving is, I have it on today. This is a NYX Butter Gloss in tiramisu I just love NYX butter glosses they're my favorite holy grail lip gloss um and I love this with kind of some darker brown nudes I know that Kylie Jenner lip is really in um I haven't really gotten into it or played with it too much yet but when I do attempt it I usually use this stuff to top it off because it gives you that perfect most beautiful stunning natural brown nude okay sorry this is so long because it's my favorite it's always going to be long a couple more things Okay, so for eyeliner, I have been, like I said, I went to a dance festival. I've been going out a lot at night and going to, like, different dance parties and clubs and stuff. So I've really been loving using this um, Urban Decay. It's called Deep End. Urban Decay 24-7 Eye Pencil. It's so soft, so creamy, and the color is phenomenal. Like, every time I wear it, people are always like, whoa, what is that color? It is such the prettiest turquoise blue color ever. It looks so good right on the inner, on your waterline on the bottom. Uh, it just will brighten up any kind of eye look and just make it look stellar. Like, so sensational, so different. I love this eye pencil. You guys know I love Urban Decay 24-7, but I've really been loving Deep Blue for summer. Another eyeliner that I've been loving is from Stila. It's the Stila Sparkle Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner, and this is in the color Electric. Uh, it is like a true teal. It's so pretty, and this stuff is just glittery, glittery, and it goes on like a dream. That's it right there. Swatch it a little. Yeah, of course I blob swatch it. Cool. So I use this a lot too when I was going out. This, if you want a little bit more of a costumey look, something fun to brighten up a regular eye look, I absolutely love this stuff. I got this on Hot Look for like seven bucks. It was like really cheap. So, love, love, love this stuff. I want to try and get in some other colors, see what they have from other colors because it's so pretty. Okay, so let's talk about lashes, shall we? I have been obsessed with false lashes this month. I've been wearing them all the time, during the day, at night, when I go out, on vacation, love it. So, some false lashes that I have really been obsessed with are from Velour. Um, um, uh, um, um, um. So, these are the Velour lashes. Oh, gosh. I'll have to link down which ones these are below, but these are my favorite ones. They are so stunningly gorgeous. I love how they're like 
thicker on the ends. So pretty. These velour lashes are mink. They're mink hair lashes. I also have these ones, which they're falling off right there. Um, and I'll link these two down below, but I absolutely love them. These are a little bit more natural, a little bit more fun for going out at night. Um, <clears throat> just amazing lashes. I'd never used mink lashes before. I got these, and now I am hooked for life. Hooked for life. I'm obsessed with them. <laughs> like, they are so good. You can wear them up to 30 times. They cost 30 bucks. You can wear them 30 times. They are totally worth it. Gorgeous, stunning, soft, beautiful. I'm obsessed. I will link them down below. Um, oh, wait. Here's the name of them. <laughs> these ones are called Doll Me Up. And these ones are called... I don't know because the name's not on them. I, that was a fail. That was a favorite fail. Okay. So, last couple favorite items. I know this is so long. I'm so sorry. So is nail polish. I've been loving this color. It's called Flip Flop Fantasy from China Glaze. It is a bright, neon, gorgeous, stunning orange coral color. Obsession. I've been loving this so much. I've actually been wearing it with this other kind of opposite spectrum color. This is Playdate from Essie. These two together are so much fun for summer. I loved playing with them for Electric Daisy Carnival. So pretty. I'm obsessed with them, especially this one for your toes. So cute with a tan. Beautiful with a tan. Okay. Um, and then one non one non beauty favorite of the month I wanted to share with you guys is this candle from Bath and Body Works. It's called Hawaiian Hibiscus, and it smells like candy heaven. It's floral, it's citrusy, it's delicious, and it has such a good throw across the room when you light it. Your whole room smells fantastic. Like, and this is on sale at Bath and Body Works right now. I'm not even kidding you. It's ten dollars. You guys have got to pick this up. It is such a nicely fragranced candle that really does fill the whole room up with a beautiful scent. I'm obsessed with this. I've been lighting it all month long. I love it for summer. Hawaiian hibiscus. Okay, this is so long. I have to stop. I had a couple other things I wanted to show you guys, but as per usual, I talk too much, so I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it to the end of this, love you guys, and I will see you again next time. Bye!